Oh, uh uh, is that a beat? Oh my god, baby! A... Oh my god, 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 oh my god
bay. Let's see if they have a tub. Okay, they have a shower, but that's fine. Shower. Yeah, y'all, this is a really cute. Um, then they have a look, came with a lot of towels. I love when they have a lot of towels and tissue. Um, it also has a refrigerator. Really nice and clean. We love that. Freezer, a ton of drawers. Then it also has um, plates, a, ref a microwave, a dishwasher. What's under here? Okay, just like cleaning stuff. More um, things to eat with. I love this purple couch, girl. This is like, it's like a content creation area. Is it not? Like that area is so cute. And then this is a mirror, y'all. This is my OOTD of the day, y'all. This is that. So we love that. And then it also have, um, we love when it have, oh, okay, other blankets. And then nice deep dressers. Y'all know we're gonna be here for seven days. So we love when it has a lot of drawer space. And this is the view, y'all. It is so cutie. So where we are going to be at for about a good seven days, honey. So yeah, we are about to probably figure out what we know what we're going to eat. I already told y'all we are going to Yummy Crab Girl. So that I'm excited about that. Uh, we definitely about to just get settled in and stuff. And girl, how cute is this swimsuit? Okay, how sexy is this, y'all? Like skirt to go with it. So cute. She is, she looks so good in her brown, y'all. Don't she look nice? To my brown, no. Look, fit check, honey. Look, OOTD, honey, a men's work. Because she is putting it on, y'all. She looks so nice. I love new colors on myself. And child, I love them on my wife, too. But yes, yeah, so now we have all of our clothes hung up. What we'll be about to get into. You think they'll have to take if you take that can opener, baby, why do you want to take the can opener? It's not broken, huh? Because hers is broke at home. Well, her, hers, her, the can opener would not be broke if she wasn't doing what they showed her to do on that TikTok. They've yeah. been showing her stuff to do on TikTok, and now she over here trying to do TikTok hacks <laughs> with the can opener, and that's how it's broke. She was like, you know we've been doing it wrong all this time. I was today sure old so when I found out how to open a can, uh, open, or it use so the can opener like this. Way. But it's broke. So well, was, it wouldn't use the right way in the first place. So it never started out right. No, you see what I'm saying here? Girl, let's, let's, let's get us some shoddy shot shots. Walking across the street because this breakfast may not be as good as that when the lettuce come on in. And she, yeah. I said, I'm going to show my reservation and come on in and eat breakfast over here. And, and they said we could do that. Um, she said, like for this, they said, come on over, just show the reservation we had. Um, it's your speech time. I did the speech on last vlog. Give a seat. <laughs> well, I want to say that I just told the vlog that I feel like this trip is going to be a lot different than all of the other trips that we have been on. Mm -hmm. I told them that I felt like it was something real special about this trip and that you did as well. So I'm not sure what it is, y'all, but something magical is going to come out of this trip. And I'm really excited for it. And thank God that we made it safe. And we're gonna have an amazing time while we're here. So cheers to that. Cheers to that. Mm. <sighs> Y'all, that was two shots. She gave me two shots. I still have it. Did you drink all of that? Give it to me so I can finish mine. <laughs> I couldn't get it all down in one time. You couldn't get it all in your mouth? Huh? You couldn't get it all in your mouth? No, I couldn't fit it all in my mouth. <laughs> She's so nasty. <laughs> Woo! Okay, so now we are about to, girl, find out what we finna do. Because we know that, like I said, we're going to get crawfish, but we don't want it right now. So we're going to head to the pool and we're going to head to Walmart. So let's go do this. You want to get up here? Comfortable. Here. Get up there. Go. There you go. Who's oh, 
somebody been walking through this hallway with shit at the bottom of they got their own feet. Walking and pooping. I mean, they've been pooping for a good minute. This is, this is horrible. I mean, it really does smell like some true six month old poop. Oh, we're about to go and check out the pool and see what it looks like. Okay. I don't know if they have a jacuzzi, but we're about to find out. Y'all, they ain't gonna tell them that it don't smell good up there because it, it smells really, really bad. But let's go outside. We're gonna go on outside, but it is really cute out here, y'all. They have like a really cute little lounge area where you can have, looks like a fire pit and stuff like that. So that's really nice. A lot of little like lounge seating. Yeah, and stuff right. like that so that is really really nice um but yeah so now we're about to head on to walmart and then where else am i supposed to go walmart grow some other place no, but <laughs> i'm gonna head on over there but this is cute here though yep so we're It's like 17 minutes away, so we're just gonna go ahead, grab our crawfish chow, and call it a night. So I'm gonna chit chat with y'all once we get to the seafood restaurant. Well, I don't know, y'all. I'm talking about that we park back here, girl. The car is bright. Okay, look at how cute it is, though, y'all. Cute little, what you said it is, maybe a Jeep Renegade. Yeah. So this is our little cute little Jeep Renegade, y'all. I absolutely love it. It is so freaking cute. And it kind of reminds me of the Kia Soul. So, and it rides really comfortable. It's good on gas, babe. It's really good on gas. And it's really good on gas, y'all, as well. Hey girl, hey, good morning. Welcome back to the vlog, girl. It is the next morning. I'm about to go down and get some breakfast. I really, really hope they have those really cute little egg omelets that I love so much. So yeah, we're gonna head on down. Jasper thought he was coming. Look at him. <laughs> but girl, we're gonna go down and grab us some breakfast. I don't know why, but it still smells like ass in that hallway. Somebody must be throwing dirty diapers in there. Because that's the only thing I could see happening. But let's go grab this with us some breakfast. It is a rainy day today. Look at that. Now they actually said it is supposed to rain, I think like <laughs> at least five days while we are here. So we won't be doing a lot of outdoor activities, but today I am planning on going to the thrift store. But y'all see that cute little that cute little outside sitting area. If it dries up, we may go down there later on and kind of relax and chill. But if not, girl, it's just gonna be a rainy day in the hotel. I am about to hop in the shower. Then we're gonna get out and do a little bit of beauty maintenance. Um, Y'all know every time I go out of town, girl, I sleep my lashes off <laughs> that night. I 
was on TikTok, I think it was. Hold on, girl. But I was on TikTok and I was looking at that thing, the, all of the beef and stuff with the Michael Ely and the making good drama and stuff like that. And I think that that is quite funny, okay? Because obviously her boyfriend was uncomfortable. Whether if the situation was appropriate or not, he was uncomfortable. So I don't know if he know maybe some history on them. Like maybe they talked when they played in that one movie, um, Think Like a Man. Y'all remember Think Like a Man? I, I'm pretty sure that's one of the movies they know each other from. But honey, her man was so uncomfortable. And so I was just wondering, like, when you or with your partner, right, and y'all are out in public, and you run across somebody that you know, like they just know you, they don't know your partner. And so this person's approach y'all, you know, start talking or whatever. Do you think it is inappropriate if you don't introduce your partner? Or like, you know what I'm saying? I ain't saying that she didn't do that. I'm just saying like in general, like just speaking, hypothetically speaking or whatever, like do you, uh-uh, I know there's some glue in here. Do y'all um, think that it is disrespectful if someone approaches you and does not acknowledge your partner? Me personally, baby, if you think you finna walk up over here and talk to mine and not speak to me, uh-uh, it don't work like that over here, poo. We don't roll like that over here.